In this video, we will discuss Wolf-Parkinson-White syndrome, its etiology, pathology, clinical features, EKG findings, and its treatment. So, what's Wolf-Parkinson-White syndrome? Wolf-Parkinson-White syndrome is a pre-excitation syndrome, a congenital condition in which there is an accessory abnormal electrical pathway between the atria and ventricles, which does not pass through the AV node. This is known as bundle of Ken that causes causes re-entrant supraventricular tachycardia. Normally, when an impulse is generated from the AC node, it passes on to the AV node before it enters the ventricle. Only a limited number of impulses can pass through the AV node. It's a gatekeeper and AV node slows down the electrical impulses. So the ventricular rate is slower than the atria because of delay in impulse in the AV node. So what happens in Wolf-Parkinson-White syndrome that the abnormal focus of electrical generation is somewhere in the myocardium and that excites first the atria and then the ventricle without passing through the AV node. So there is no delay or slowing of the impulse. So atria and ventricles beat almost at the same rate. So the impulses that are generated in the bundle of Kent they cause paroxysms of tachycardia, atrial fibrillation and rapid ventricular rate. WPW syndrome is one of the most common cause of tachycardia in infants and children. Symptoms include tachycardia, palpitation, dyspnea, lightheadedness and syncope. Child collapses while playing and recovers without any abnormality. So what are the EKG findings in the Wolf-Parkinson-White syndrome? There are delta waves, slurry on the initial portion of the upstroke of the QRS complex. Number two, short PR interval and number three, wide QRS complex. The wide QRS complex is not due to conduction delay but it's due to abnormal electrical focus that excites the ventricles abnormally. The treatment of the Wolf-Parkinson-White syndrome. Medical and surgical. The medical treatment. Atrial fibrillation and ventricular response may be treated with procainamide and quinidine to stabilize the heart rate or procainamide and cardioversion may also be done. The AV node blockers are not given in Wolf-Parkinson syndrome. So and what are those drugs? A, B, C, D. Adenosine, beta blockers, calcium blockers and digitalis. And what's the definitive treatment of the syndrome? Destruction of the abnormal electrical pathway by radiofrequency catheter ablation.